Yeah, you know, they're, they're a good hockey team. They're defending Calder Cup champions for a reason. You know, we learned a valuable lesson tonight. We can take some uh, some things from this game. I, I thought, you know, that they blocked a lot of shots. We missed the net a lot. Uh, we circled a lot. Uh, you know, just a lot of things that you can't do against a good team, or for, for that matter, any team, and have any type of success. It seemed to be a totally different hockey game than last night. Last night, up and down a lot more. And, and these guys, just a, a different game. They seemed a little bit more physical blocking the shots as you said they, they really seem to collapse and not let anything get through yeah you're right uh, griff you know they uh they block a lot of shots uh they're heavy they're in lanes uh they stop and start uh, they play a real simple game uh they chick pucks in they lean on you they got a strong four check they make simple plays well uh you know they manage the puck well uh things that you have to do if you want to have success at any level they seem to have more sense of urgency tonight too moving their feet a little bit getting to the loose pucks yeah, they won a lot of foot races. The score was 5 nothing. They outshot us, I think, 41-21. to 21. Uh, Like I said, we missed the net a lot. Uh, this is a game that, that you uh, you take a lot of lessons from. Um, I'm glad it happened this early in the season where we can, you know, we can build upon where we have to be if we want to be a good hockey club and compete for the uh, championship. You know, early in the season here, it's always interesting to see how a team gels and, and kind of comes together and regathers after a loss. Uh, how do you see the next week going? Well, I, I think there's, like I said, there's going to be things that we're going to point out in the video, and we're going to work on those things that we need to work on to have success and to be consistent at this level. I was say, you said good that happens early in the season, not too bad, and that's because you can teach from it. Yeah, definitely. Like, uh, if this were to happen in, in game 45, like, you know, there would be some heavy... Uh, you know, uh, caution signals, I guess, moving forward. But, you know, uh, we're a young team. Uh, and like I said, this was a valuable lesson for us. And, uh, you know, we'll uh, we'll deal with it for the next uh, day here. Uh, we'll park it and then we'll move on and we'll get better for this week.